Hey. Oh, no. I thought I cleaned my fingers. Okay. Let's get the nasty hair in here. All right. Hi, it's Linda. Well, I would be diamond painting right now to show you how much I've done, which is like almost nothing. <laughs> From what I did last time, I haven't touched it. Well, yeah, I did touch it, but I didn't record. And then I have, well, I'm relapsing. Yay, multiple sclerosis is just a wonderful disease. Um, I can't feel my left foot up to my knee. I cannot feel nothing. It's the most strangest feeling I've, it's... It's completely numb. So, um, you know, when uh, it's really almost like a tingling a little bit. But if you ever your foot falls asleep and you try to walk on it and you feel like you're going to fall or you can't even do it, you got to wait till it's fully awake. Well, that's how I feel. So yesterday, it actually started yesterday morning i my i just got this pain in my foot and my ankle and i'm like why is it hurting this feels weird this feels weird but it didn't click in my ms so because i had to go to a bridal shower yesterday it was beautiful oh my god so beautiful i loved it and the food was so good too um she did an amazing job everybody was awesome so um Basically, uh, I felt this pain and then it just doesn't want to go away. And I'm like, okay. And my foot felt weird the whole day. And I was just like, okay, I'm trying to brush it off. Like, all right, maybe you hear the train and that's the train. <laughs> maybe it's you know, going somewhere, like something, not going somewhere. Like I did something to it. Maybe I was go doing something, like I went somewhere and did something, but I'm thinking, no. Well, I get home, take off my shoe, boom, can't feel my foot at all. And I'm like, this is such a weird feeling. And I'm like, ma, my foot's numb. I go, way to go. It's my mess. She's like, you can't take anything. And she's like, maybe rub a cream. I'm like, no, ma, it's not my psoriasis. I'm like, no, it's my MS. It's starting. Like, I don't know. And I'm trying to call the hospital to let them know because they, they want you to tell them if you're experiencing a relapse to let them know because they can mark it down. When the neurologist finds out, he can say, okay, come on in. We'll do this. We'll do that. Because last time I was on steroid treatments for four days, five days. And uh, I had a nurse come to my house every day, give me my, my stuff. Oh, the joy, the joy of having MS. So, um, yeah, love it, right? Well, we'll see what happens. I'm trying to call the hospital, but they're not answering. Uh, I guess they need to change their machines, but I'm having a cannoli. My fat ass is eating one. Um, a, my family friend, a family friend, opened up a bakery beside me. And, of course, we've been friends for years, and these cannolis are so good. Now, these are cannolis. Now, there is another Italian bakery, but they don't make them the same. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. They use whipped cream. Cannolis are not made with whipped cream. They're made with a ricotta. Okay? Ricotta. And you can put chocolate chips in there. And it's just delicious. So, anyways. I'm going to relax my foot. Um. Yeah. Because I have nothing to do. I can't do anything. Which really sucks. Walking around really hurts. I just made it to the couch. With my coffee, I didn't spill it, but I took my time walking because it it's it hurts because I can't feel it and it's numb. MS sucks. <laughs> it really does. I it, it really does suck. Oh, but oh well.